Guys, for this video is I want to share about what is the difference between uh, these two switch. And here, if we see the switch, and we see here is a three pin, and this switch will be nine pin. Basically, these two switch are the same function, but to control these will be much more able to control more devices because there is a nine pin and this is only three pin so the three pins we only control the two devices so which means in the middle is command and left is one device and right is for one device so this three pin we control for two devices so for example i have one diagram here i have two devices which is i use as lamp here two lamp so these three pins, they will control two lamp. So in the mirror is a common. So you can apply this diagram as uh, DC or AC. So for example, I'm going to put input for 240 volt AC. All right, so a live cable we connect to in the mirror here, in the mirror of this switch pin, and we control one light button. So here this is one light bulb and the other side of the pins we control another light bulb so lamp one and lamp two so the three pins will be on and on if you push to this side and this switch uh, this light will be turned on if you push to this side and this light will be turned on so if you don't want to use for two and you can only use one light button so you don't have to connect this to uh, this light so this three pin you can just use to control only one light but it's a waste of the switch so uh, <clears throat> so the purpose they designed for this three pin is to control uh, left and right but anyway if you does not have uh, three pins if you does not have a two pin switch you still can use one light one appliance all right so uh, this is how you we can use the switch so basically if you already understand how to use a uh, rocker switch a uh, three pin that is the exactly the same function with uh, this type of the switch so just only the pattern only the design is a different but the function is the same but the only things for these two switch different is this switch we handle only for 6 ampere so the current is a small so you can just control for a small light bulb and this switch you can control 15 ampere so which is a much more bigger uh, model or the light so the ampere is much more higher so just like the heavy duty so uh, you already understand this tripping toggle switch how to use this and okay for for example if you want to make sure that the switches work and you can simply select your multimeter to uh, connectivity or otherwise you can make it the buzzer my battery is low so there's no sound right so at least you can see there is connectivity and the good switch so in the middle is common, you just place simply to the red and this side. So this side is off, but if you put this side, then this side will be turned on. Right, so if you push the toggle to here, and this side will be turned off, and this side will be turned on. So one side off, one side on. One side on, one side off. So this is good. So oh, what is the difference between these two? Here is the 9 pin. So the body is much more bigger size. And since this is 9 pin. And why we use the 9 pin is because of sometimes if you want to control one talker and you can control six devices. So here's a very simple diagram I will drop over here.
So he, so this is the way that we look from here. If you, uh, if you apply 240 volt, or you can apply 12 volt, or you can apply a 24 volt, any voltage you can apply. So uh, here is, for example, we're gonna use for uh, 240 volt. Alright, so the live wire we come into in the meter. In the meter is here. So in the meter, this is basically the three piece of the three pin switch they combine together to one body. So you don't have to use a separate three switch. Then you just use one switch. We control uh, six devices. So live wire we comes to in the meter here. Then you can look to each of in the middle pin here all right so you can simply control one light bulb here and the other one here and the other one here and this side is over here so it's a very simple but it's not necessary you must use all the pin if you require to control only two <laughs> light bulb then you the rest pin you know you don't have to use the rest pin this will be depends on how many devices you want to control. So if you just want to control for the three switch here, the three uh, device here, yet you don't have to use this side. If you just want to control left and right, left and right, and four switch, then you don't have to use this this pin. All right. So this is very simple. The idea that uh, what they make a nine pin switch is because they don't want to use for three pieces of the toker switch and they make you one piece of the toker switch then to control six devices all right so this is very simple but if we do not understand how why they make it uh, the nine pin switch then we gonna be very confusing so it's a, actually it's a very simple you just have to very clear about how to use Two pin switch and a three pin switch. So once you already understand the three pin switch, then you will be able to wire this nine pin switch or twelve pin or no matter how many pins switch, uh, you can very easily to understand and to use and to uh, wire. All right. So I hope this video will help for someone. And thank you for watching my video.